The supine roll test assesses the horizontal semicircular canal for the presence of displaced otoconia that is causing vertigo. To begin, the patient lies in supine with her head in midline and pitched up 30 degrees. Maintaining this head position, the patient's head is turned to either side. In this position, the examiner will be looking for horizontal beating nystagmus. This is also performed on the opposite side. Depending on the direction and duration of the beating, various conclusions can be arrived at. Beating towards the ground is known as geotropic nystagmus and may be indicative of canalothiasis of the horizontal canal. Whereas beating away from the ground is known as apogeotropic nystagmus and may be more indicative of cupular lithiasis.